Hey there, my name is Adam Lore, and I'm the founder and CEO of Wave Boating. And today I'm going to show you how to automatically create a route in Wave Boating, otherwise known as auto routing. So this is one of the most used features in the app um, and one of the most exciting features as well. So really there's a couple different ways you can go about uh, starting an auto route, but uh, I'll show you some of the more obvious ones and we'll expand upon that. So first off, the bottom menu, tap navigation. This is where you'll be seeing uh, the variety of our navigation features. You can do auto route, a manual route, or record your trip. So in this case, I'm gonna tap auto route and I'll be brought to this view. So this is where all I need to do is set my origin and my destination. So from here, you can tap within the origin bar to bring up the search menu and you could search out your origin or you, there's an option for you to, in this case, tap to my location and same sort of thing on the destination. In this case, I'm just going to tap on the map to set my origin and destination and let all uh, way boating figure out that route. So first off, you know, here's my marina so i'm just going to tap at the entrance and today just exploring along the map um i'm going to head to ivy lee so again i'm just going to set my destination by simply tapping on the map and then once those two points are established and everything looks good on your end just simply tap calculate and let wave do its work so at this point it's now factoring in the draft of my vessel um, current water level conditions uh, obviously avoiding any types of obstacles and what wave will do is look at the nautical channels around you so that it will take you on the most practical route we're not trying to get you on the fastest route but the route that's going to follow nautical channels that you would practically take as a boater so for example you'll see here uh, the route is following along the nautical channels, keeping me between the red and green channel markers, very important. And then when it makes sense, it will diverge away from the channel to take you to your destination. So from here, you can save this route. It will then load into your navigation menu. So maybe you're just doing a bit of trip planning at home on the couch. You want to save this for later, just tap save at this point. Or maybe you're ready to go, you know, I'm at the dock. I'm, I'm excited to get out and get on the water. Then simply hit start. At this point, the app will ask you to uh, check your location privileges. And it'll bring me to my location. So I've got, you know, 30.1 miles from where I am to my destination. And as I start to move, um, the remaining time and distance will be calculated accordingly. So I'm just going to close that now. I'm just going to show you uh, how you can get to auto routing from navigation or sorry, from the search menu. So if you hit search, uh, I'm going to say Ivy Lee. There we go. Auto populate came up with the result I'm looking for. This is the Ivy Lee club. I'm going to tap that result. It's pulling me to the correct location. Yeah, this is where I want to go. And from here, you'll see the big navigate button in the bottom right. So again, if I tap that, I'm brought up with the navigation features. I'm going to hit auto route. And just like that, my destination is auto populated and the map will bring me to my location to define the origin. So again, I can either just say, yep, I want to go from my location or tap on the map if say I'm not at uh, my dock, for example. Any questions, please reach out to our team at community at We're happy to help you out with auto routing. It's a feature that we love to use and we hope you love it too. Thank you.